Hi guys, um, I just wanted to come on here just to show you this um, vintage bow front hutch I'm working on. There was some water damage to the back panels here. Um, as you can see, you can see, let me see if I can show you. See how warped it is, how it's just peeling, flaking. Um, so what we're doing is we got new paneling to put into install. So right now I'm taking out all the, the wood trim that holds in the panels here. And this is probably probably early 1900s, so the wood is extremely brittle. So you gotta be very careful taking it off. And what I have is I have my nail puller, putty knife, and my five and one, which this is great. It's much more firmer than the putty knife. The putty knife can bend. So this is nice to get through behind the nails to kind of bring them up a little bit. The pick area here is good to get in by the nails to pull it um, apart or pull it closer to you. So I'm just gonna show you how um, I'm doing it. So I did the top and the side here. I could probably squeeze this out, I can, but I don't wanna damage this wood. Let me see, this wood right here. So I'm gonna start with my five and one because I have a pretty good gap here. If I was really super tight, I would have taken my putty knife to get in there and just pull from the frame a little bit. But because there is some space already, I'm able to put my five and one in there. So what you do is you find the nail and you just kind of pull it apart a little bit from, you're pulling the nail out from the frame slowly because this wood is extremely dry. And if it breaks, it's not a big deal. If the wood cracks, you could just use some wood glue and, cr and clamps. It's just, it's an added step. So. Just taking your time will work for you. So here we go, I got it off, okay? And then my panel should be able to pull out very nicely. And you can see all the bubbling that it has. It's just peeling apart. So we can't sell it to our customers. So we're gonna install new paneling and um, then it'll get ready to be primed.